Hello guys, welcome back to episode 30. In this one, we hit up two on Sunday and the bank holiday, Monday. Doing a kind of a double one here, because Becky, she didn't do anything on Monday, but I've done most of the recordings, so I'm showing you my stuff and Becky's stuff to save her doing a little video, because she's only got about three or four items but now we'll get on with the clips and I'll see you in the pickups so, yeah I'm just looking at this one scar face and the lines How much is the 20 pence? Thank you much. Wake, wake up the <laughs> late night last night. Two in the morning. Yeah, not quite as bad as that, but uh, yeah. Just the DVD player. Um, four pounds. Four pounds. Yeah. Oh, 
Just the uh, fiver. Game is just here. Okay. How much are they? Oh, they're all um, priced to go, darling. I'm just taking 20 p each from the store. Oh, right, yep. Yeah. It's not very expensive, so most of it will be like just trying to get rid of stuff. 50p down. Because I've got two sheds full still. Look Well, I 
I said today is 20 peach. And if you have to do I just got one off you. There you go. Thank you very much. Um, yeah, actually, there's actually mm -hmm. kettle plugs. Kettle plug ones. No, we need we need like we need um, figure of eight. Sure these are right for PS3s. Yeah. Yeah, we need a few, don't we? I've got one anyway. One, two. Yeah, could do. Thank you. How much are the wires? Um, 20p. 20p, 60p. Yeah. Got three of them. Are you doing 50p? Yeah, I do. Yeah. Yeah, you could have. What it was. Back here. Have you got any computer games? Do you know? So I just noticed your wheel in there. And how much is the uh, steering wheel? One you can feel it. I don't actually have to feel a bit pale. Yeah. How much is this anyway? Ten pounds. Ten pounds. Yeah, I don't actually. Yeah. Thanks. Buttons look all right. Oh, you got? Yeah, yeah sure. Yeah. It's Xbox, isn't it? Yeah, it's Xbox. Yeah. Let's have a quick look at that, isn't it? Man, that's bringing back some memories, that is. <laughs> nice. How much is the. Um... <laughs> So double check the battery compartments. Carefully. Yes, I mean. Three pounds. Three pounds. Yeah, thirteen. Yeah, that's right, that's right, that's right. <laughs> Just wondering if you've got any Xbox games to go with that. Or is that all the games you got, them two there? Uh, both, yeah. Games. Just them, just them two, have you got any more? No. No, just them ones, okay. Uh, maybe, That's a... I don't know. Yeah, I'll hang around for a little while. You come? Yeah, I'll come back. Okay. Yeah, so okay. that's uh, 10, 13, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, no, that's what, no, no. 
Just these. Look around there. Right. Oh, you got some. Lovely. Back. How much is that one, please? One pound. One pound. Yeah, I'll have that for you. I got the game, sir. Oh, have you got some? Yeah. Hmm. You mean something like this? Oh, yep. Yeah. I'll have a quick look at them ones. There you are. All covered all this. Hmm. That's quite cool. Yeah, it's like Pac-Man, but different version of it. I love that one. Got Paul Paradise. Need for Speed, Crazy for the Racer. Interesting or not? Bit of railway. No. Depends a bit of work on your thingy. This yeah. is Windows 95, 98. Yeah, so it should. My older, yeah. my older PC should work it. Yeah. Just have a look at this as well. It's in that pad as well. Yeah, I know. I'm looking at it, actually. Uh, I think, yeah, that's gone. So I'll see how bad it is. Might clean. Ooh, bugger. Can't get out. Yeah, the batteries are well gone, but it's old, so I might better clean it up. I got this with this. That one. Ooh, that one as well. <laughs> that one's a bit mega old, but it's a bit rough, but really old so that might fix if i take the lens out of that it might fix my um mega cd yeah. so it's a sony so you never know how much are these how much are they eight pounds eight pounds give me two pounds for this two pounds it's just a lot of work to uh, get those out and it's coming off quite easily. So yeah, it might be worth a little go and see for two pounds. I'm back down there for a minute. I don't know if you want to keep those, they're, all, they're gone. Yeah. Yeah, they've gone completely. How much is that one, please, as well? I don't know. One pounds? Fifty. Pounds? Okay, pounds. Yep, pounds, that's three pounds. Come look at that, please. This one. Yeah. I've never seen that before. It is for Amiga, for Commodore C64. Ah, mm. uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Probably get it for the Mega Drive as well, because it's the same connection. <laughs> How much is it, please? Five pounds. Five pounds? Yeah, I'll give that a try for a fiver. Five and three and eight. What's up? Oh, yeah. How are you? No, not too bad, are you? I'm right, What's that? That's, uh, eight. Eight. Yep. <laughs> oh, yeah. No, I'm going to charge the double. <laughs> <laughs> Should have. You got any money back? And that is worth a lot of money. I bought it for, I think it was working, and he had like all the games. What do you need? Oh, right. one, two, three. And uh, I bought it, and I sold it for around about like four and a half thousand pounds. Flipping hell. As well, that's what you want to see. You get that's what I've got eight. Tell his own, because sometimes when you open it up, it's all changed, gone though. Got any notes? I've got 20 of you, I'll just give that a sign. Sure. Done anyway, yeah. Right, so yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Why not grab it? Oh, right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Actually, I can take one of them. That's eight. <laughs> just double check it, it should be eight there. Three, three, three. Yeah, there's two in the morning for me. <laughs> Hello guys, sorry about that, I literally just bought this for a quid. It's just an empty box though. But condition's quite good, so hopefully I've got the game. And I might keep it, might sell it, I'm not too sure. Not 
your videos, mate. Oh, huh? yeah. Oh, yeah. Videos. oh, thank you. Very good. Keep me entertained. Yeah, I know. I try to do my best, but <laughs> I say, you probably watch Kieran and that lot. Yeah, I do, yeah. Yeah. Good stuff. Hey, like the third person to meet me. <laughs> I've only been doing it for like two years. Yeah, I know. Right, I'm Jason. Give me a 10. Turn it. It turns on. What colour is it? Oh, bloody woman. It's on already. Yeah, she's looking. She's looking. She's looking. She's looking. It turns on. Yeah. One moment, doing the deal. <laughs> I thought I was going to do a separate one for How much is the... Make me an offer. Yeah, it works. Just plug it in. Yeah, and TV, stick it in. Batteries. Yeah. Oh, I was really going to have a go last night and I'd be playing for ages. Got instructions. Got instructions. Well, no box, though. No box. Those pounds for all those. They are fifteen pounds for those because they're brand new. Thank you. All right. Thank you very much. No car temperature. Uh, no, I'm thinking at the moment. Yeah, go on. Think away, but yep. Thank you, both. No, you're all right. Yeah. Size five on the seat. Yes. Yeah. They're quite a small five as well. Yeah. Never mind. We take a pound for it. Yeah. Go on. Yeah. I'll just take off your then. One more. Do you do it? Do you do it? Oh, it's a little change. Yeah. Didn't, want to, didn't, didn't want to give you a 20. No, no, please don't, because you won't get changed. Uh, I like that. That's the only oh, problem with them. I won't bring too much change, because everybody will give me it, hopefully. That's the only problem with cash machines, they give you 20s. Yeah, yeah, you're right there, and you want, yeah. You want change for the day, then. Well, where'd I put my zip? There it is. Really? 50p. Really? 50p, oh. it's brand new. What do you want from Stanton for? Are you liking Stanton? Yeah, just pop them. If you get them out and just pop them here, that'd be great. Yeah, that'd be really helpful. Do you want that? Oh, you're going to have them. I'm looking at it, though. Only before you go. Stuff out the car, how, much the, how much is the game? Uh, pounds. Pounds. Have you got any more in there or is that the only no, one? I think that's, that's the only one. I'll tap them off yet. There you go. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. How much you got in your games, mate? Uh, four quid for the front one, so a couple of quid for the back ones. Uh, you want me to take some of those? No, I think I know. You know, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to have 10 for them, 7 for them. Good luck, mate. Yeah, Andrew, catch you later. Uh, put it in the front, though. Yeah. I hope you got a quiz. Yeah. <laughs>
It's just about there you go. I'll be struggling if I can have Oh, yeah. There you go. Ah, thank you very Cheers. much. Have a good day. And you. Yeah, sorry, we're not giving him one away. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Sorry, sorry, we have it. Hmm? Oh. That'll do. How much is the wee mate? Um, Ten. We, we run it up last night, it'll work. Oh, my God, there is. They're all five pounds. Hey, you got to the change. Yeah. There you go. Thank you very much. Thank you. You ain't got any computer games in there, mate, have you? Mate. Any computer games? Do you no. know? Uh, might have. Well, I've got old Nintendo, baby. <laughs> Oh, you got some PS1 games I'll sit at the bottom, I'll just notice them. <laughs> That's alright. Yes, I did, yeah. Yeah, check it's got some Yeah. Sorry, I'll check conditions as well, so I'm like a collector. Oh, yeah, that's mint. I like it when people look after their games. Yeah. <laughs> Can't stand them. Let's have a look at these, mate. The other one. Okay. Yeah. Oh, they are a pair. Okay. How much are they? Um, how much do you want for these? Um, five pounds. No, I don't. Yeah. Thank you, mate. No. Right. Yeah. All right. How much are these anyway? Huh? So, yeah. I'm sure for these. How much are the games? Games? Yeah. Quid. Quid. Quid each. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'll finish off you. So, I'll see, see if you've got any more in there. I well, I'll no, I can, no I can see them from the side here, yeah, but I can't I, see anything. I think it's mostly it's all CDs. Ones, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ones. yeah. I don't know if you've got any more in there. I can't see any. Yeah, it's, it's music some of these play with things like that. Yeah, I'll still play them. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I've got a log cabin full of it. 
<laughs> I'll, I'll go all the way back to like the um, Atari. Yeah, yeah. And I'll just enjoy it. I loved it when I was a kid, you know. Yeah, you just can't, you just got to grow over them though. Yeah. You get into gaming, it's like, it it's sticks addictive. to you. Yeah, it is. It's addictive, isn't it? <laughs> but no, I just love finding them as well. Yeah, yeah. Some, but no, uh, some good stuff oh yeah, you do. See, I have to bring my How much are the bowls? Oh. Barbecue cover. Sorry? How much are the bowls? Do Check condition. Five. Five. Yeah. Well, that, that was the Morrison's price. And then, obviously... Then, like I said, the men's and women. Didn't know if it says on them. What they are. They're size four. That's all I can tell you. <laughs> Super grip. It's a light. No problem at all. Tiger bells. Yeah, I'm not sure whether... Yeah, so the, the other thing that threw me was when it says four, size four and on the box it says size three. Uh, that's, right, what, okay. so, that's what. That's That's why I'm not too sure if it's the same box. The right box. Possibly not. So it might be the bolts from here in one of the box bags. Yeah. No. Yeah, these are size four. I would suggest that maybe the ones out of this box are probably in one of the bags. Then might be in one of here. Oh, you got some more, have you? Oh, you have, haven't you? Size ones. Size ones. Size ones in there. Uh, Lots of these bags. I don't know which one, but no, I think it's the size of them that's really. Yeah. Depends how much you want for the lot, because I uh, say so he does quite oh, no. shoes as well. Oh, oh, yes, there are a set of bowls in there. Yeah. All wrapped up. Shoes as well. So I think they're probably the women's, but I would guess Yeah, I'm guessing they are the way that looks. Looking at that, that's probably the mum's bowls and so her shoes. So. I imagine they're slightly smaller because of women's hands. Yeah. So is it a woman that you're buying for? Or? Size zero. <laughs> yeah. That makes nothing to me. <laughs> no, I don't. You don't need a pistol, mountain. How much should you do for the lot? Sorry? How much should we do for the lot? Well, with a bag and everything. Yeah. 15 quid for all three. 15. Sound fair? Yeah. With the bags and stuff. Oh, bloody hell. That's heavy. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, it's the same because the same stickers. Yeah, so I see it. Means nothing to me, but no, it's no, not my thing either. I don't. I'm not. Yeah, here yeah. she have them. Yeah. Sorry, she have them. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Do you have? Of... Then she can uh, try them out, see which ones work. Yeah. Sorry. Lovely. Yeah, Hello. mate. She just said she'll she'll Cheers, she'll mate. she'll work it out somehow. Now I've got to try try to carry him. No, <laughs> it's gonna be fun. <laughs> this gonna be fun. The car will be on there if you want to come back for him. Yeah, you? I'll probably take the two bags and come back for the box. Okay, yes. Yeah, next to the bike. Yeah. 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 Whew. That one, and... <laughs> oh, definitely. That's actually yeah, not I heavy. <laughs> Tell you the truth, in the bag, they're not actually heavy. Oh, I'm going to show you the stall now. This is what we're selling today. Just bits and bobs we're trying to get rid of. Load of games, all doubles. Yeah. Becky there, wait, being bored. Cold. Cold, <laughs> she says. It is actually quite nippy today. But no. And we've still got 
about a shed full of stuff to get rid of. Oh, welcome back to the pickups, guys. Right, in no particular order, because um, there's quite a lot of stuff. I'll show you my stuff for the game side of things. First car boot went to, the regular one. I picked up driver for the Wii. Uh, I think I paid 20p for this. She was like, all her games were quite cheap, but she only had one, unfortunately. And she had like DVDs and stuff. Yeah, next one I went to, saw these in a box. Marked up at a pound each. I think was that a pound each? Yeah, a pound each. So I picked up. These were at the bottom of the box, and I'm surprised they were still there. Sim, Sims 2. Sims 3. And Dolphin Island. Nothing really to shout about that one. That's cheapy. About 120 in CX trading. But that was all the gaming stuff on that one. Right, if I show you Becky's stuff now, if I remember which one it was. Picked up a Samson. Here's a Blu ray player. No, DVD player. But as I say, we're going to be keeping that because we've got the Samson TV. At the moment, we've got. Oh, is it Wolfdale? DVD player with a boom box, but that's how we're trying to get all stuff woofer. So we've got that. I can't remember, should I pay for that now? Four or five quid? Yeah, I think it's four quid. With, couldn't believe it, with the controller. So that was that was a bone, and it works as well, so that's definitely staying. And the second thing she picked up, well, actually, you, I picked this one up, but as I say, can get it it's a Panasonic mp3 and CD player all in one can't really get it so it's all looked up the speakers on the floor and I can't get it up <laughs> that's the that's the sound so wrong <laughs> but no there's no iPods everything like that with our stereo in the unit at the moment it's absolutely naff so I saw that, I thought that would replace L's, and it sounds brilliant. As I say, it's, it plugs in through the speakers, so that one weighs a ton. This one's the lightest one. But no, I think that was a five I paid for that. Don't mind paying the thing, and as I say, it works perfectly, so I'm happy with that one. Right, second car boot we did on Sunday was the one we we stumbled across last week so we went back there and had a look and this time i did film it um well oh, i can't remember what i got first oh right i know what i got first looking looking around saw this in the back of the back of the car it. Ooh, Christ, there's good players. saw that in the back of the car a thrust master if I remember this, a Ferrari 458. And I asked her how much she wants for it, and she said tenner. So I grabbed that straight away. It's for the 360. Um, been playing with it, it is top notch, and I say it's going to be from the 360 wheel from now on. Same stall, this is um, Becky stuff saw this the old boombox from the looks like the 80s kind of thing it might even be 70s I'm not too sure there's nothing same it, to the back of it, it looks greyish so it looks the 70s but the only oh, I'm not sure, I'm not sure, I'm not sure, let me just pay for this three quid? yeah I think it was three quid yeah ten three yeah, and we bought two. something health sauce from but no um, got it home hooked it up radio works the only problem is the tape player doesn't work um someone else on ebay's got exactly the same one and it's the same problem so i'm not too sure if the tape 
players and naffed on these. But as I say for, I think, four quid, I'll three take a quid. three quid, I'll take a punt on it. We could probably still make some money on it. And the other thing I've brought off them, I'm not too sure if I've got all this off them or i actually got two stores, I can't actually remember. If you remember, in, if you looked at the video, I'll probably did put them in. Load of kettle wires, I think I paid like 50p each for them. They're good for like PS3s, the uh, fat version. And two, fig I'll call them figure of eights. Well, that's a kettle lead one. But no, I'll call them a figure of eight because they got like the figure of eight plug in the back of the unit. And as I say, they were like 50p each. Always pick up wires, you never know when you need them. Right, that was that stall. Walking around again. Oh, no. I've actually, with that wheel, I did pick up, I can't remember where I put it now, Need for Speed, da, 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 da. is it the streets, I think, for a pound for the 360, so that's what I've been playing with that in the room, and it, oh, unbelievable. Right, next one, I can't remember where I picked that up from now. I have no idea. If you've seen the video, I, m I must have paid, ah, yeah. She had a bomb load of games in a box and she wanted like 20p each from And I was going through them and they were absolutely wrecked. Every last one of them. That's the only one what was in any decent condition. For 20p I grabbed it. Right, next door I went to. Don't know why I picked this up because it is really, really bad condition. Um spot a bit of corrosion on the back in the battery case so i can't remember i think it's a quid i think i paid for that you paid three quid for that three quid no it wasn't yeah it was three quid for that and then a five i think the i thing. think i made a mistake on that one but no um i'm not tried it yet but let's say these these do go but not in that condition i think i messed up same stall this was sit on the floor. Look at it. He said it was um, a Meagle or Commodore, but it's actually for the Mega Drive. I've seen them on list on eBay, and uh, they come up as Mega Drive. So I think that was oh, was that pounds? That was a fiver. That was a fiver. <laughs> I'm, I'm, this is like Tuesday, so um, I'm completely forgetting what I've actually picked up. But no, for a fiver, I'll grab that. Not tried it yet. Just looks really old fashioned. Right on my street. Same stall. That was a pound. That was that was a pound. <laughs> <laughs> um, saw it in a box. Pac Max. It's exactly like Pac Man mainly, but for the PC. It's actually it's all kinds of different things. I don't know if you can see it in the back on the back. It's like mazes and original Pac-Man. So for a quid, I thought I'd grab that. And that was... Yeah, that's the Sunday car boot. Let's move on to the Monday car boot. Uh, we actually did a car boot sale. Literally, we did a stall. Um, I've actually put it in the video, so... You probably see us setting up... Well, I didn't really say it, but you see what I was selling. Um, on to the pickup part of it from going around buying well it's, it took me a bit of time to actually find anything because i thought to myself oh this is going to be one of these days where i'm not going to find jack but then it all started turning around i was like yes first thing i saw was in someone's front seat it was really weird because all i saw was that on the seat ps2 buzz uh, PS2 box asked her how much you want for the PS2 she turns around and says oh it's not got PS2 in it it's got books I thought oh, great there we go so I just turned around to her and said how much you want for the box so she was having nothing I said would you take a quid and she said yep so PS2 buzz the Hollywood quiz no inlays but as I say I think I've got the game and the system so 
I'm not too sure if I'm keeping it or flipping it, but it just looks a decent box and it is in good condition. Becky's laughing. Yeah, I'm just thinking that it proves that you'll buy literally anything. Yeah, well, well, <laughs> Becky just says exactly the same. Uh, it literally proves that I'll buy anything. But in, in reason, that is. Right, walking around, one of my friends on the car boot coming to me. I've known this guy for years. And he doesn't really buy games, but I think he buys for someone else. But he said, Do you, am I interested in a DS? I went, yeah, alright, have a look at it. So he pulls out. Stack of games, DS, and a charger. And a charger. Look at the shadow but games. Let's say, Mushy Monsters. Michael Jackson Experience. Not too sure if we got that one. Shrek Ever After. Forever After, yep. Yeah. And this one I know I've got. Sonic Rush. System, I think it's a silver one. It's got a couple of games loose inside, but it's nothing brilliant. Um, Let's Draw and Brain, Juni Brain Ju Junior. But no, silver system. And probably I did try it, but yeah, it does turn on. It's a bit fingerprinty. But he said. Give, it, give him a tenner, so I'll just grab that for a tenner straight away. The prices on the games are like a pound each, so I'm not too sure how much to pay for that. But for a tenner, I'm well happy. He's probably made a bit of money. I've made a bit of money, so everyone wins. Right, walking around again. Oh, do you remember a couple of episodes ago, they saw that... GameCube game, um, The Sims Pets on the GameCube for like, you wanted like 10 quid for it. Well, I saw him again today, um, Monday, and he had it on there, so I thought I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be cheeky and ask him and see how much he wants for it. Turns around, I want 4 quid for it. I thought, from a tenner to 4 quid, okay. So I was looking at it, then he turned around and said, I'll oh, just give it 3 50 So... I picked up. Um, they see except for six quid, so three fifty. I'm gonna grab it this time. Disc, perfect mint condition, so that's going straight in the collection. This one's gonna be flipped because um, I think I've already got it, and see it's give me a, give you a bit of money for it. Fight night champion. So uh, I think I paid like 50p for it and I think CX give you a 4 quid. So that's getting flipped. Around the corner from that. I picked up that for a pound. Not got it in the collection because we've got one. One of them but that one we haven't got so that's in the collection. Coming back because I had to drop this lot off. I noticed... I think it's this one first I noticed. Space Invader jo joystick with instructions. And she had said made me an offer, so I said quid. She took it. So for a pound, stick in the TV. I think I've got one of these sealed, I think, I'm not too sure, but I'd say at least I can play that one. And Oh yeah, I picked up another Wii, love getting these, got loads of them now, we need to get them sorted and get them gone because I must have about 8 or 9 of the damn things, <laughs> they're multiplying, but no, Wii, oh Becky's got the games, got a pile of games, a Wii board and all the wires, only one controller though so, but the games are Mario and Sonic at the Olympics. Wii Fit Plus. Good old Mario Kart. But the only problem is a little bit scratched. So might have to get a disc cleaner and give that a bit of a polish up. 
Might give it to, might trade it in CX or might sell that on eBay. Not too sure yet. Wii Sports. Just realised that's actually uh, the case version. Bonus. And Wii Fit. As I say, the Wii Fits would probably go with the boards. And a couple of manuals, Wii Fit manual and the board manual. As I say, you got all loads of wires and stuff, but as I say, you got like it'll connect um, add ons. But nah, that, that lot usually just gets chucked because it's just not worth it there. Alright, that was that one. God. Right. Couple of bit of retro here. Nothing. Well, only one of these is the big, the big buyer. Couple of PS1 games. Got Point Blank for a pound. These are off the same stall, but I had to ask him, and he said, "Oh, I think I've got some." And he pulled out some CDs, and these were in it. So I have to spend. I have to look at those games, mate. And this one's the Money Maker. If anyone sees this on the car route, buy it. If, if for a quid. It's a good one. Namco Museum Volume 4. Mint condition. Um, checked it up on eBay. They go from 55 to 59 quid. So for a pound. That's definitely it. It's in my collection. So I don't think I've got that one. I know I've got a few of these. But I don't think I've got four. And then the final thing. I think. Yep, these ones are Becky, um, but also I, I actually picked them up because... There's a oh. game down there, that you got some games down there. Where? Never kid. Nothing done that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> she She's not taking any notice of what I'm doing here. I actually did get something for Becky, actually. Until she turned around and said, why did I buy it for you? For her. And I was thinking, oh, I thought I'd give her a present. Not often I give my other, my other half a present, but no, she collects um, Cornwall sign, like pointy signs, so like um, Gorn Avon, Mevagissi, St Ives, that kind of stuff. But I picked up this one, Hun Stanton. She loves going to Hun Stanton. Why would I want to sign for it? Yeah, exactly. See what I mean? <laughs> but no, I'll pay fifty pence for that. It's new and sealed. And she doesn't want it. Typical. Um, right, back to this one. We've been watching people on YouTube, um, yeah, YouTube, buying, selling people, and a lot of people buy these. So we've 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 started buying them now. We've already got one on eBay. Is the bowls? It's one of these sports where I never got into, or never interested in it, but these go like nuts. Yeah, so um, I thought I'd pick these up. I've got three sets. Um, I think I paid 15 for them. Five yeah, five of a set, so it's an easy flip. But no... Uh, I'm not going to get them all out because there's so many of them and they're not really they're light. Stamped. They all look the same. They're, they're all look the same. They're all, they're all round and they're balls. <laughs> but no, that's it I think. Oh, no. Almost forgot. This is another flipper because it's one of these games what's probably going to go down in, in value. But while it's high, get it in quick. Madison 21. I think I paid £4 for that. And I think, if I remember, it goes trade at 10. So, £6 trade profit for a NES or SNES game. I might give it a try first, see what it's like. But I remember playing like the Mega Drive American Football Madison. Used Madden. to love Madden. Used to love playing that. Right, and that's it. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Oh, another thing, actually, before I forget. I did meet a um, subscriber at Mundi's car boot. Um, big shout out to Gareth. Nice to meet you mate and hope you did well buying. 
And as I say, I hopefully see you somewhere else in the future. Anyway, enough of me mumbling on. I'll um, see you in episode 31. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe. And have a good day. Bye. Becky says bye. Catch you later.